What's up, y'all? Today, Monday, the 11th. Just wanted to do an update for y'all. You know? Everything been going good, though. Well, kind of. That golden, that golden... GFP right there it don't it don't really be wanting to eat as much it'll eat but not as much but as if, if, as y'all can see I put <clears throat> real red wigglers and earthworms in here today I didn't do the normal um blood worms but besides that you you can see the two melanoids they looking good the other golden it's looking good. The GFP wild type is looking good. It is is then put on a little bit of weight. And the Lucy <clears throat> is over there. Y'all y'all get to see it in about um sixty seconds a minute or two. But I just wanted to give y'all a good update today because I know I've been slacking and ain't really been giving y'all no decent updates on like them growing and all that how big they didn't got and also i'm gonna do a um a care video like a axolotl care video um the bush you can see the bush the bush thing grew a whole lot they they just hang on the top of it now like every time i um feed them though i cut the bubbles off and that's that's kind of how they know when it's time to eat but y'all can see everybody like Yeah, everybody doing good. And I don't have a lid on top. I really don't like a lids. Excuse me, I don't know if y'all saw that. I hope y'all didn't. Cause they see the axolotls that jump out and all that, but none of my axolotls ever jumped out any of the tanks I ever had. I, I, I haven't had a problem with that. I ain't gonna see none of them, but I haven't had a problem with that. I don't know where that little melted part come from. Probably overheating a light bulb or something. I don't know. When I got the tank, it was already like that. So. There's the Lucy. All right, so there's everybody. That's everybody. Um, toothless, Milfy, Nikki. Um, that's all I got so far. I haven't thought of no, no names for the other two. Maybe y'all can help me with that. That's the ruler right there, so y'all could basically see, well, y'all can't see because the ruler all fitted out and stuff, but they basically, they, um, there was three inches, they started off three inches, they started off three inches, let that focus for a second.
It says M A G A A L A N W A. Three inches, three inches, and three inches. And that right there, that's um, Radiator Slider, um, Lease Killies Culture, Bristle Nose Playco, and Albino Playco. And that's um, the dates when, you know, I got everybody. And y'all you know I got all them from the Reptile Convention. So, yeah. And a few of the least killies did pass away. Unfortunately, when I did a um a water change, and they did lose their gills, especially um Melfi. And I kind of think that's why her appetite kind of been a little bit off because she's been focusing all uh, energy on regenerating her gills. So yeah, and like it just went horrible. So from now. On, I make sure that I fill up a tub, treat the water, and let it sit overnight for 24 hours before I even do the water change. So I do the water change the next day, you know. But like I said, I make a care. I'm gonna make a care video, and I'm gonna um like add all that in and let y'all know, and you know step by step uh how I go by and what I do and what I feed my axolotls and the diet that I have them on. So yeah. You know, a diet of, you know, basically live and, and, and frozen food. You can even add in some crickets if you want to, like, but I'll make a cat video. That probably will be the next update, so, yeah. It'll be a cat video on these guys, axolotls. What a bit of information, not just caring, but, you know, background information, like where they come from and, you know, things of that nature. But yeah, like all my axolotls, I have a spot for all of them in my heart. Like, I love all of them. But also, I'm a, I, I can tell y'all this. I noticed that Melfi, she 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 prefer live food over frozen food instead of blood worms. She would rather eat the um you know the red wigglers and the um and the night crawlers. Like she rather that. I'm just hoping that she, um, she get her appetite back and she get back healthy. Well, she's healthy, you know, just get her weight back like the rest of these guys and girls. I don't, I still don't know males from females, so probably I have to change the names or switch the names around, but, um, like the next two months. Y'all will find out when I find out, so yeah. I'm kind of starting to see um, some knots and, you know, stuff forming back there. But it It'll be definitely clearer in the next two months. I'll be able to tell for sure. So, yeah, like I said, um, y'all will find out when I find out.